Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to another episode of Scrap Mechanic. We're here with our toilet elevator. That's been, uh, well, let's let's just say flushed. Uh, I took out all the toilets because it wasn't working as well as I thought. I could have, you guys suggested that um, I put the toilets upside down, like, like so, like that. And then you teleport to the top of it. So all you do is just bloop, 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 and you go up to the top. That's a really cool idea. Um, I wish I would have thought of that when I first made it. But I thought to myself, I said, self, maybe we're going to try to build a rocket that can go up inside this thing. So I wanted to do that, but I have been playing around for maybe about, oh, three hours or so, trying to make a rocket that doesn't get stuck. And I'm going to show you guys what I mean by that. So if we do a, a four by four base, because the inside of this is five by five, right? A one, two, three, four, five, and then a square. So that's five by five. If we do this, uh, we need to put like a, a little one of these machines over the side, and then we can go boop, and boop, and boop, and oopsies. You get back in there. Don't want to destroy our world. And then we can put like rockets on the outside here. Um, maybe, like so. Uh-huh. Get rid of you, you should fall down normally. Get rid of you, and you. And then we can put a seat on top of this thing, right? Boop. Okay, like that. Oh, and then we need to put, uh, this is one of the hard parts too, is, let's go. So levers have weight, or these switches do. So we're gonna, we're gonna put these inside so there's equal weight in there. And then we're gonna close that up. So it's like hollow underneath with those things. And then we can just attach all these to one. Make sure they're all the same, and I'll attach the one, and then we'll attach that. And it should work. All right, but you see, it should be straight. But watch, it doesn't always fly straight, which is really weird. Um, I mean, everything is even, oops. Everything is even on it, but it just doesn't work like we'd want it to. So let's just try it in here for funsies. We're gonna, we're gonna do that and then we're gonna close it up. And I'll just show you guys how a rocket launcher doesn't work. It always gets stuck in the side. Like, I mean, every single time. Uh, I could up it to a five by five, but it, it gets stuck all the time again. So, there's no real way to do it. That I've found. I mean, one of you guys might be smarter than me, which probably, as most of you guys, is smarter than me. So, um, I don't really know what to do for making a, a rocket lifter. So, I started, no, excuse me, I started tinkering with wheels. Well, this thing just gets clogged, and it doesn't work at all. Uh, I figured I wanted the wheels to be stuck out, and that didn't work. And I also... I also tried it the other way, so the wheels were touching the sides, and it just didn't work. I could not figure out a way to make it work, so I thought we would make a vehicle that would drive up the outside of it. That sounds kind of cool, doesn't it? Maybe. We'll see. So, I don't really know how to make a base of this. I think we're going to use wood. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Let's make it centered here. And maybe like that. Let's go out like three. One, two, three. We'll do that on all of these. Okay, one, two, three. And we're just going to make it permanent. Uh, permanently surrounding. Like that, like that. I hope it's connected. Sometimes some of these don't connect. This might not work right. Whatever. We'll try it. Let's we'll see what happens. Okay, now we disconnect it. Nothing's falling yet, that's a good sign. Must have add, added some sort of, oops, magnetism to the game. Hold things together. Okay, so, I mean, that looks fine, right? That looks pretty good. We got something stuck around the outside. Now my goal is to create some sort of contraption here that I can attach, like, up. And then we can have wheels here and here that attach to the main thing. Like, that little bar is going to go in. It'll attach to it. And then we can just drive right up. I hope this will work. Uh, if not, I don't really know what else to do. 
Okay, so all of those are in, and they should work if I smack them with a hammer. They should just flop forward. Unless I did things incorrectly. We'll see. <laughs> let's let's put down a platform here. Let's go out one, two, three, four, five, six. Should be good enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I'm just gonna try that and we're gonna hook up the controllers to it. Mm-hmm. I'm just adding these for so it's even all the way around it. Except they don't look right. Eh, that's fine. And let's hook it up. I like how you can click through things like that. Okay, and now we're gonna do, ooh, I don't know how many degrees, and which way does it need to go? Blue? Okay, we'll just start with blue. We'll see what happens. 30 degrees, blue, 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 blue. And, oh, that's so cool. Okay, I'm gonna finish this up. I'm gonna put, oh, these aren't gonna be equal. Let's put in toilets in front of each one, just to level it out, like that. How about, we, how about we do it to the back? That looks better. All right, so that's like a, a toilet ride. Looks kinda cool, we're gonna have to get some sort of engine in here too, aren't we? Uh, let's do the electric engine, since that has more torque. And how do I want to place these? I don't know how to place them. Maybe on this. Well, we only need one, really. Let's just add multiple for making it even. We don't want it to be too uneven. It could get messy. Toilets could flush the wrong direction. Okay, there we go. And just for the sake of this, we're going to hook up. Oh, I guess we could do them. We could do multiples to the same one. Or we can just do each to their own. That sounds cool too. We'll do that. So it makes each one feel special, although it does nothing different. All right, now we need to hook those up. I'm thinking I'm gonna hook those up to just one switch. Okay. And we're gonna trick it. We're just gonna hook them all up to one, even though I don't know which one to hook it up to. With this one. Okay, so all of the chairs are now hooked up. Everything should go. This should should work. Oh! That's awesome! That is so much better than what I was messing with. We could add rockets. Ooh, I don't know if we'd want to add rockets. I, I think... Wow, that is really neat. Help! <laughs> Get your head mashed in, buddy. Okay. Um. Are we slowly sinking down now? We have a slight problem here. How are we ever going to get this thing up to the top? And how are we going to get it down if it's stuck at the top? Because, I mean, it's stuck. Nothing's in there. Um. Whoa. Houston, we got ourselves a nil problemo. Hmm. I feel like I could get up. Bring that up a little bit. Is it? Here, let's try something. No, I can't even I can't even get down on it anymore. Okay. Get rid of that. Okay. And now I wanna touch you to there. Aha! Uh -huh. Well, <laughs> that's neat. So it doesn't like going down very well. Hmm. That's not too bad, though. Let's see what happens when we hit the ground. Oh, that's a bad problem. 
That's a really, really, really bad problem. Let's drive it out. So we do need thrusters on the bottom of it to make it easier, cause we have to we have to lift it out of here now. Oh boy, not good. I don't know if I, it'll work. I don't know if I can do this. So we have to get the thing inside. Uh oh. Uh oh. Did I break it already? Did I break our new toy? I might have. Shoot! How do I get it over there? Okay, so kind of come up with a plan. Um, looks totally normal, doesn't she? We got all of the wheels up. If we go down here, we can just remove all the wheels in. That's going to drive it up the top. Uh, if we hit this one, nothing happens because there's nothing connected to it. This one is our wheels. They're turning. Oh, probably help if we turn them on, wouldn't it? Bloop, bloop, bloop. Okay, so those are going. And now, how am I going to get around that post? I'll check this out. <laughs> we did it. You know, I should slow that down a little bit. I connected it to this one. Let's slow her down like that. And then that's better. That's better. See how much nicer that is? All right. So we're going to stop it now, hopefully. Boop. There we go. Now, how do we get this thing in there? Because we still can't pick it up on a, on a lift and put it around. But I've been thinking to myself over here that I could that I could do that, do that, do this. And then we could kind of just, well, you can't fit it in there, right? But what I might be able to do is create like a, I like how it, it's attached to the bottom of the two wheels there. What I might be able to do is mark it here. Um, mark this thing like a the spot where we want it like this. Like that, and like that, and then that's going to be our permanent placement in there. But we could probably build up some, like a conveyor belt here. Be up and over like two, and then it would rest on this, and we could pop in wheels. Oh, that's not going to work, is it? No, we have to go up three. We go up a third one here. We can make this pretty with other blocks, but meh, that's no fun. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. F one, two, three, four, five. I think it was five in between. Yeah. Okay. That's this one. Get rid of you. Come up. Three. Over all the way. Over. Awesome. And now, you can just do this. Okay. Now, if we remove this thing, it falls right on there. We can hook up an engine. I guess to like two of these, maybe. That's the wrong way. Okay. Forward and forward. And then we'll put a switch in. We'll turn this up a little bit. That would work if we extended it a bit more, wouldn't it? Okie dokie. Should we try this again? I increase this up a little bit. So we should have plenty of wheels now. Okay, we'll try it. Just for reloading. We'll place that down. Flip the switch. Drives forward. In place. We can turn the switch off. Should be able to. That worked well. Come over here. That's awesome. That is totally cool. Now this one should make everything right. And now, we're right up to the top. Oh, we doing it. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. It works pretty good. I mean, for being a, wow. And I forgot about this part of it. Now it's stuck up here. Ha, <laughs> we did it. And now I can drop it if we use this. Whoa! Okay, hold on here, Bella. 
right yourself again? The question is, can we get out and drive it midway? Oh, wow. Whoop. Okay, whoop. Almost fell off. I kind of like it. It gets stuck because the wheels don't free roll. Free, freely turn. Oh, it's not good. It's not so bad. Okay, now it's good. What happens when we hit the ground? Yeah, we get stuck in everything again. That's totally fine, cuz... We can reset it. We have the technology. Let me put you over here. And then now you go in here. Exit. Drive it forward. Yes. Now come around. And... Bloop. Cool, that's in place. Contract. I have a feeling that we don't want to go that many degrees. Let's bring it back to 15 and see what happens. I feel like that's part of our problem. Okay, 15 isn't enough. Let's go up to 20. You can do, if you hold down shift key, you can, you can do it individual ticks if you don't have the game. Does that work? Can I see light through there? I can't. Um, I don't. I don't think this works quite as well. I don't. I feel like this doesn't quite work well. Hey, still made it to the top. I guess that's what matters, right? It's kind of weird. <laughs> it's like you jump off of it. Ow. Okay. You know, I'm messing around a lot, aren't I? Just dinging around. My parents would be proud of me. Playing video games, just being a derp a derp. Okay, go and up and click and go. Falls down. We'll connect it one more time. I don't know. I think this works pretty well. Not as pretty as I wanted it to be, but... It works. I'm going to go to 25 degrees here, and we'll see how this goes. 25, 25, 25, and 25. Well, this is at least reliable. Okay, it's in. You know, it would probably help if I did one of these. Okay, that's, that's nice. I do want to turn down the speed of this, too, maybe might be part of our problem. I don't know. I feel like it works pretty well. That looked nice. Definitely better than trying to make a, a rocket inside that took me two hours to do. This was only like 30 minutes. Ha! Excellent. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. I'm going to think I'm going to leave you with this for today. Um, and then next time, we're going to start beautifying this thing up here. Let's see what we can do. This was to catch the rockets if they ever did come up, which they, they never did. Uh, yeah, but I hope you enjoyed this video. If you got any ideas of what we should do with the sky base, let me know. Uh, it would be very, very, very much helpful for me. I think we have to release that every time that we come... Oh, no, I didn't want to fall. Oh, well. <laughs> Bloing? Oh. Do we have a falling? See, now there's a problem. If she gets stuck on her own, then we'll have to go rescue it with the... The UFO. I don't think it would get stuck, though. What a derpy machine. Oh, I got another idea. I got another idea that we could use. Once it goes up, mm, we could make it drive down. That'd be a little more difficult to do. We'd have to do this. We'd have to go up a little ways. Like that. Make it stuck. Is this too high? And we could bring down another one, but we'd have to we'd have to work it differently. Huh. I'm gonna think about that. Like I could bring a maybe a bar across and down and then hook up wheels on the bottom. And then and then we could go, but it can't interfere with our runners here. Huh. Oh well, thank you for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. If you did, let me know. And keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.